Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and if you're new, welcome to my channel. My name is Maria Guadalupe. Before we get started with today's video, please make sure that you subscribe down below and that you hit the little campanita. That way you don't miss out any video that I post. So without further ado, let's get started. So in today's video, I'm going to be doing a last minute um, New Year's Eve look. So I know that New Year's Eve is here, it's today. But you know what, if you're still in your sala and you're like trying to figure out what should I wear or how should I do my makeup, well, I got you, girl. Here is a very simple look. So I'm gonna start off with Reina Rebelde eyeshadow palette it looks like this and this is called tapatia so i first of all what i i got this um like the nude shade and so that's what i'm going to be applying all over my crease and then i took a different blending brush and i went into the modern renaissance palette and i dipped into burnt orange which is this shade here i already actually hit I actually already hit pan on it, so I'm going to blend that on top of um, the other nude shade. So now that I have both of those colors blended on both eyes, I'm going to go in with, with the black shadow in the Tapatia palette. Honestly, I'm very nervous right now. I've never actually used the black shadow, so I don't know how I'm going to look. I don't know if I'm going to look super crazy. I don't know if it's going to look good at all, but, you know, I'm already, like, diving into it, so I am a little scared right now. I don't know if it's going to blend well. I don't know if I'm going to look como una loca, so I'm just hoping, whoa, that is super pigmented. I think it me, se me pasó tantito la mano with this black eyeshadow, but I I don't know how to act right now. Whoa, this is dark. This is this is this is this is negro, like straight up negro. But let's see. Whoa, that's super pretty. That's that's a very pretty black. The way it blends, it's I mean you guys saw I just straight up packed it on and it blended out so nice. It blended out so so pretty. So now that I have the black blended on both of the eyes, I'm going to go ahead and add the silver shade of the Tapatia palette um, onto my lid. And one of the cool things that I do want to mention about this palette is that you could use all four shades that it comes with. Um, you could use them either dry or wet. I did use the black um, dry just because the black is already super intense. And this very specific black, it's super, super pigmented. So I didn't want to add any more pigment to the black or I would literally look crazy. Okay, so now I have both eyes with the silver shade. So the Reina Rebelde Tapatia palette, that silver is not a shimmer shade. But as you could see, like it's very pretty and it's very pigmented. But just the type of person that I am, I love shimmer. So I'm going to go ahead and go in with the Jeffree Star uh, Morphe palette Custom Rims. Which is this shade in the corner right here. And I'm just going to go ahead and take that on a brush and apply that on top of this shade. Ooh, and as you could see, it just adds like that extra, extra shimmer. And it looks so pretty. So this is the outcome. This is how it looks. I went ahead and added the Lashes Saddle Up by, by the Western Lash Co. 
I'll go ahead and link their Instagram down below just in case you guys are interested in picking up any of their lashes and I'm gonna take my Kat Von D foundation in the shade 57 medium I'm gonna add two pumps of that to a flat kabuki brush and I'm gonna finish up this look so now that my face is all finished I'm gonna go in again with the Tapatia palette. I'm gonna dip into that black shade one more time and I am going to blend that some of that black in the lower lash line. I'm adding that little by little just because I don't wanna end up with like a crazy amount of black. <laughs> So I went in with the favorite lipstick, which is by Viva Cosmetics. This is their, in their kit from their Get Matte line. They are now repackaged, so if you purchase one, they won't look like this, but their formula and everything is still the same. And this is in the shade Maria. And I'm gonna I'm going to top it off with this lip gloss from Forever 21. It's my favorite. Um, one of my favorite lip glosses is in it's in the shade Top. I'm not sure if that's how you pronounce it, but I'm going to top it off with this one. And to finish off this look, I'm going to go ahead and set my makeup with the Mario Badescu Rose Water Setting Spray. So this is the final look. so happy with how it came out um i had never worn eye black eyeshadow before and i thought i was gonna look like they beat me up and i had a black eye but actually it looks very cute um i'm so happy with all the products that i used and i am very happy with the final look so i hope that you guys enjoyed this video and that whether you use this look for tonight for new year's eve new year's day um for your birthday whenever you use this look i hope that this video was helpful and that you guys enjoyed it so without further ado happy new year happy um new decade oh happy end of the decade happy happy new year feliz 2020 i hope that all of your 2020 is full of love happiness and blessings i am so happy that 2019 is over it was a rough year but it was the blessings always outweigh every negative um situation or any obstacle so i'm just so happy to be healthy and be able to see the start of a new decade um so i'm so excited for 2020 and i hope that all of you are excited as well thank you so much for being part of my channel in 2019 i know that i haven't been uploading as consistent as i should but um i hope that 2020 allows me to bring more content to my channel and like always if you guys are not subscribed already please subscribe i hope that you guys enjoyed this Video and feliz año nuevo. Nos vemos en el 2020. Adiós.